And who are you? Okay. Okay. I like the music. Oh, I saw that killer. I like the beat. Hey, pop killer. What's up? Oh, oh, yeah. Okay. Mm, mm. Okay. The trickster. Dang, right in the face. Okay, trickster. He ain't scary, but okay. Ooh, that suspense music. Run! Oh, that baby! Welcome to Dead by Daylight. Narrator! Binding of kin. You're back? Family <laughs> is woven by sacred and powerful bonds. But in the entity's realm, even kinship is perilous. Uh-uh. The new killers are the twins. The twins. Can join twins. I remember you guys. Hi. And Victor Dei formed an emotional bond like none other. After a life of hardship and suffering, the entity has twisted their love for one another into Jeez. something truly terrifying. The I twins bet. The power is blood bond. Blood bond. Devastate. Though forever bound by blood and trauma. The twins have been granted the power to separate from their shared body. Together, Charlotte and Victor hunt as brother and sister, doubling the threat to survivors. Oh Use gosh, ugh. To separate the twins. Ugh. Choose to control either Charlotte or Victor, and hunt your victims as a deadly Oh, look at the baby's hands. Oh jeez, no. Controlling Charlotte. Ew. Trial, triggering killer instinct to reveal the location of survivors. Who are near him. However, Victor can be crushed by survivors. While oh, nice! Is being controlled. See, they if need crushed, to fight. Victor will eventually regenerate okay. onto Well, that didn't work. Special attack pounce. That is so While disturbing. Victor, uh. You can pounce onto survivors. Successfully landing a pounce deals damage to the survivor. Ew. If the survivor ends at full health. Victor will latch onto them, afflicting the broken, oblivious, oh my gosh, and the new no. incapacitated status uh -uh. effect. Victor will also reveal the locations of other nearby survivors with killer instinct. Survivors can attempt to fight Victor off while he's latched yes. onto them. If Victor misses his pounce, he is momentarily vulnerable and can be crushed by survivors. Yes, kick it! The twins kick it. come with three <laughs> new perks. What are stranger, they? Protect your stockpile at any cost with hoarder. Okay. When survivors interact with a chest or pick up an item within range of your location, you will be alerted to their presence. If there are enough spawn points available, spawn two extra chests. Hoarder reduces the rarity of items found in chests. Give them a taste of what you've endured with oppression. Oppression. When you damage a generator, other random generators are also damaged. If any of those generators are being repaired, any survivors repairing them must face a difficult skill check. Their progress only makes you stronger. Close stronger, baby, stronger. Coup de grâce. Whenever a coup generator is completed, you gain a token. Consume one token to increase the distance of your next lunge attack. Okay. New survivor, Elodie Rakoto. Cunning, smart, and resolute. Elodie oh, Rakoto okay. spent her life trying That's to... That's a weird name, but okay. I'll take it. Parents. 
Grief-stricken and guilt-ridden, Elodie turned to the occult to find the answers she was looking for. Elodie comes with three new perks. Keep a sharp what eye out for resources with appraisal. Start the okay. trial with three tokens. If a chest has already been opened, you can consume a token to search it and retrieve an item. You can search chests much faster. Conceal your true intentions with deception. While sprinting, Rad, rather than entering it's a lobby, coming. you will instead pretend to enter it. You leave no scratch oh. for the next three seconds. Smart. Resolved and tenacious. Oh dang, it is right there. Okay, wow. With that worked. Struggle. If you fight hard enough against the killer's grasp while being carried, you can drop a pallet to stun them and free nice. yourself. Hunt as a deadly pair with the yeah. twins, or fight to survive as the unwavering and determined Elodie Aracoto with a binding of kin in Dead by Daylight. By Daylight! Okay. Welcome to Dead by Daylight, Chapter yes. 17. See, he was just Experience taking a break. The That's of it. Ambition with Descend Beyond. Come on, narrator. The new killer is the Blight. Ah, a bright and light. ambitious chemist, Talbot Grimes once sought to enhance humanity through his experimental compounds, only to become a victim of his own ambition. The Blight's power is blighted corruption. Pustula serum courses through his veins, corrupting his mind and body, yet granting him what a weirdo physical abilities. Special ability. Rush. Press the power button. Yeah, look at your hands. Down. While performing a rush, the blight cannot launch an attack. Dang it, goes fast. Okay. Rush into a wall or obstacle to slam onto it. If you fail to connect with a wall or Jeez. obstacle. You will enter a fatigued state. That's so messed up. Special attack. Lethal rush. Following a slam, press the power button to launch a lethal rush, which allows you to move quickly and attack survivors. Wow. The blight comes with three new perks. Spread your corruption with Dragon's Grip. After damaging Dragon's a generator, grip. Any survivor that interacts with it will scream, revealing their location for a moment. And Why will be you've got to scream? The status effect for a brief duration. Offer no mercy with Hex Undying. When Hex Undying is active and a different Hex totem is cleansed, that Hex will be transferred to a dull totem so long as one exists. When within short range of any totem, survivors' auras are revealed for a moment. Remove any opportunity for escape with Hex, Blood Favor. When a survivor is hit, nearby pallets are held in place by the entity for a moment. These mm. pallets cannot be pulled down. New survivor, what? Felix Richter, a visionary architect. Felix uses his relentless determination to form a plan and help other survivors. Felix comes with three new perks. You've always had a knack for seeing what others could not. Show your allies the path to victory with Visionary. If you visionary. are in short range of a generator, you can see its aura. Let pressure be your motivator with desperate measures. For each okay. injured, hooked, or dying survivor, slightly increase the speed at which you heal and unhook your allies. Get the most out of your tools with Built to Last. Once per trial, a depleted item will have some of its charges refilled. Let ambition drive you, but tread carefully. The line between ambition and hubris is razor thin. Experience the corruption of the blight and the ambitious spirit of Felix Richter with the Descend Beyond chapter in Dead by Daylight. Well, that guy is screwed. 
This is so good. I'm liking these spotlights. Welcome to Dead by so Daylight. good. Chapter 16. Narrator, I'm glad you're back. Experience Don't the leave. Twisted brutality of Silent Hill in the realm Silent of Hill. the entity. I know that Enter game. Midwich Elementary School. Though desks and textbooks remain, they are eerily contrasted with blood-stained walls, okay. chains, and hanging. Oh, uh, there you are. There you are. The new killer is Oh yes. The executioner. I call him Pyramid Head. And merciless. Pyramid Head is fixed. There we go. Dispensing punishment through pain. Come on. The executioner's power is rights of judgment. Okay. Open the gates of suffering and be judged. The great knife splits the ground, giving rise to an infernal construct and spreading agony to all who approach. Uh-huh. Survivors who step through the trail will have their position revealed for a Death short time. Death Daylight is so cool. They I mean, they have almost, torment. like, every character. If survivors fall into the dying state while suffering from torment, they can be banished to a Cage of Atonement. Mm -hmm. The Cage of Atonement is a new way to sacrifice survivors that is exclusive Look at to that. the executioner. While rights of judgment is active, Pyramid Head gains access to a special ability. Yeah. Punishment of the damned. Mm -hmm. This attack allows Pyramid Head to unleash a punishing wave that damages survivors from a distance and through obstacles. Uh -huh. If a survivor who has already been hooked twice finds themselves in the dying state while afflicted by torment, Pyramid Head can initiate his special ability. Yeah. Final judgment. Yeah. Rather than being sent to a cage of atonement. Oh, that looks painful, Jace, will now. Be mercilessly executed where they grovel. Pyramid Head, you don't the play. Executioner comes you and the other killers. New perks. Unleash punishment with forced penance. Okay. Survivors who take a protection hit briefly experience the oblivious status effect. Tear away all hope with Trail of Torment. After kicking a generator, you become undetectable for a short duration. During this time, the generator's aura is revealed to all survivors. Activating Trail of Torment incurs a lengthy cooldown. Jeez. Calm so down, Pyramid Head. Jeez. <laughs> with Deathbound. Deathbound. When a survivor heals an ally while Pyramid Head is out of range, the survivor performing the healing action will scream, revealing their location and activating Deathbound for a moment. Mm. While Deathbound is active, the survivor Ooh, will come suffer in. from the oblivious status oh. if they stray too far away from their healing. That guy ally. left, he's like, see ya! The survivor, Cheryl Mason. Okay. Caring and I've impossible. seen her in that Cheryl cinematic trailer. Allows her to survive mm -hmm. through immense hardship. Yes. Stay in contact with other survivors and plan objectives. Cheryl comes with three new perks. What are they? Your dark past has made you resilient. Press onward with Soul Guard. Soul After Guard. You heal or recover from the dying state. You briefly gain the endurance status effect. While cursed by a hex, you can fully recover from the dying state. Oh, nice. Awaken your sacred bond with blood pact. Okay. When you or the obsession are injured, you see each other's auras. After healing or being healed by the obsession, you both gain the haste status effect for a short duration. Using blood pact reduces the odds of becoming the obsession. If you do become the obsession, blood pact is deactivated. Ooh. As a veteran of terror, you understand fear better than most. Haha, <laughs> in your face! Use the darkness to your advantage with Repressed Alliance. Repressed Alliance. After repairing generators for a long duration, Repressed Alliance activates. When the perk is active, press the active ability button while repairing a generator to call upon the entity to block the generator for a moment. Okay. The perk deactivates. The aura of affected generators will be revealed to all survivors. Oh. Find redemption or inflict punishment with the Silent Hill chapter in Dead by, by Daylight. Daylight.
Here is the next chapter for Dead by Daylight. Oh, I think I know this. Cold, unrestrained vengeance with chains of hate. Chains Enter of the hate. Dead Dog Saloon, an early settlement on the unforgiving frontier. I think the I know this killer. Hold up a sec. In a ruthless, bloody gang war. Guns fired indiscriminately, cutting. Is it that guy with the shotgun? Mm -hmm. When the uh -huh. dead outnumbered the living. Come on. By nightfall, only the crows remain, feasting gluttonously upon their victory. Yep. The new killer is the Death Slinger. The Death Slinger. Hi. Caleb Quinn made a career out of revenge. When his wealthy Ew, your eyes. inventions, he broke into a violent, bloody rage. Mm. While paying for his crimes in Hellshire Penitentiary, the warden offered him a deal. Fill What's his the private deal? prison with inmates, and he would imprison the man who stole Caleb's life's work. Ooh. Armed with a weapon of his own invention, Caleb became a brutal and efficient bounty hunter. The I bet. I mean, look at him. Is the Redeemer. The death the redeemer. ingenuity affords him the ability oh, yeah. to deal in bounties with a unique invention, a heavily modified... He's just afraid that he's going to miss. That's why he has that. Projectiles ...with a razor-sharp spear, a fixed yeah. chain. Survivors who find themselves ensnared by the Death Slinger's chain spear will have only a few moments... Come on, girl, pull. Pull it off. In. Use those strength. do manage to break free... They will suffer from a deep wound. If they fail to escape in time, they'll come face to face with the Death Slinger's bayonet. The Death Slinger mm. comes with three new perks. Gearhead. Years Gearhead. of in his workshop tuned the Death Slinger's senses to the sound of clanging metal. After hitting survivors several times with a basic attack, Gearhead Ugh. activates for a short duration. When a survivor completes a good skill check while repairing a generator, Gearhead reveals its aura for as long as it continues to be repaired. Oh, behind you, girl! Oh, oh, oh! The entity rewards patience and bloodlust. Dead Man Switch activates for a short duration after the killer hooks the obsession. Any survivor that stops repairing a generator before it is fully repaired will cause the entity to block that generator while Dead Man Switch is active. Okay. Hex, retribution. Let them dig their own graves. Any survivor who cleanses a dull totem will be temporarily oblivious to the killer's presence. If any Hex totems are cleansed, the auras of all survivors are revealed for a brief duration. New survivor, Zarina Kassir. A What's up, girl? Workaholic filmmaker. Zarina strove mm -hmm. to reveal the truth. Inspired by the story of a massacre at Hellshire Penitentiary, she set off to uncover the truth about the Irish outlaw who had heartlessly slaughtered the warden and his guards. After oh, managing okay. to infiltrate the prison and locate the outlaw's dilapidated cell, Zarina ventured inside but found more than she thought. You missed, bud! Zarina comes with three new perks. Off the record, stay silent, stay alive. Once you are unhooked or escape from the hook, off the record activates. While off the record is active, your aura will not be shown to the killer, and grunts of pain oh. caused by injuries are silenced. Oh, nice. And Harry, send your pursuer chasing false leads. After briefly working on a generator, you will see its aura. The generator stays highlighted until it is fully repaired. Unless you start working on a different generator or you enter a locker. Entering any locker will trigger a loud noise indicator for the killer at the highlighted generator's location. Triggering Ooh. red herring incurs a lengthy cooldown. For the people, sometimes helping others means sacrificing your own needs. If you're yep. at full health, you can instantly heal a survivor from dying to injured, or from injured to healthy. In the process, you yourself become injured, receive the broken status, what? and become the obsession. 
Equipping this oh, come on. reduces the odds of you becoming the obsession. Watch the out! Hatred oh, can geez. be a powerful motivator. It can turn some into instruments of justice and others into weapons of vengeance. Experience unshackled retribution with the Chains of Hate chapter. Available now. Who's next? Cursed legacy. Here is the next chapter for Dead by Daylight. Come on, Experience the wrath of the Yamaoka bloodline with Cursed Legacy. Cursed Legacy. For a samurai, honor is everything. But one sense of honor can be corrupted, manipulated okay. by dark, unknowable forces. Enter the Sanctum of Wrath. Once opulent and well tended by priests, this shrine was abandoned for reasons unknown. Paths that once welcomed weary travelers had become thick with vegetation, growing damp and unrestrained. A stranger shuddered with rage as he stepped into the area. Unable Who to restrain himself, he unleashed his might on the statue atop the shrine. Even after he left, a rot seemed to pervade the air. The new killer is... the Oni. <laughs> As his legendary Hi, father's invitation, he embarked on a dark <laughs> pilgrimage to prove his worth and rid Japan of the no farmers see. and peasants posing as samurai. His morbid cruelty, bloodlust, and heartless rage earned him the name Oni Yamaoka and attracted Oni. the attention of the entity. The Oni's power Looking is sick. Yamaoka's wrath. The desire to destroy weaker bloodlines shaped into a literal force. The Oni absorbs blood orbs left by injured survivors. Once he's collected enough orbs of blood, the Oni enters blood fury mode. Oh. Once active, the Oni will sheath his katana and switch to his devastating kanabo. Blood fury also grants the Oni access to powerful abilities. I bet. Demon I mean, Dash allows the Oni to cover large distances quickly, closing the gap between him and his victims. The Oni's like, I'm coming Demon for you. Strike extends the range of the Oni's leave. attacks and immediately puts survivors into the dying state. Oh. The Oni comes with three new perks. Zanshin Tactics. See what others cannot see. The auras of all nearby pallets and vault locations are revealed to the Oni. Zanshin Tactics briefly deactivates any time the Oni hits Jeez. a survivor. Ugh. Blood Echo. Make them suffer. When a survivor is hooked, all other injured survivors suffer from the hemorrhage status effect and the exhausted status effect for a short time. Nemesis. Know your enemy. Nemesis. A survivor who blinds or stuns the Oni becomes the obsession. Anytime oh. a new survivor becomes the obsession, their aura is briefly revealed, and they become oblivious to of the course. Oni's presence for a short duration. Of course, Oni, you're just jealous. New survivor. You jealous. Yui Kimura. Despite her traditional upbringing, Yui Kimura became one of Japan's most accomplished street racers. She broke many records and shocked the world. She also she attracted cool. the attention of other aspiring female motorcyclists, who began to wear I elements bet. of her signature pink suit. One evening, during an Why illegal she street race, she sped through thick black fog and suddenly found herself in a strange and unfamiliar realm. Yui oh. comes with three new perks. Lucky Break, leave no trace. Anytime you are injured, Lucky Break activates. You won't leave any trails of blood for a limited amount of time. Once the full duration oh. has elapsed, Lucky Break is permanently deactivated for the remainder of the trial. Any means necessary. Use your environment to your advantage. Reset drop pallets to their upright position. Using this perk incurs a lengthy cooldown. Breakout. Inspire hope in your allies. When you are near a carried survivor, you move faster, which, in turn, motivates the carried survivor 
to wiggle faster. Oh. Breaking okay. tradition is a difficult route for everyone. For some, it is a route of blood, oil, and grit. For others, Fight. it is one of rage, <laughs> cruelty, and madness. Experience the grit and the wrath. I mean, even if they the will fight, like, come on. Eoni would have kicked Available their butts. Now, everywhere. How can they fight that thing? Like, come on. Here is the next chapter for Dead by Daylight. Experience stranger things. Oh, stranger things. In the realm of the entity. <laughs> the in the small Midwestern town of Hawkins, Indiana. Wait a, a sec. government experiment goes awry. It's that creature. Unleashing an otherworldly creature into the world that turns the lives of its residents upside down. I've never seen Stranger Things because it's, it's a lot of seasons, but I know that creature. The Hawkins National Laboratory, a dark place that was once home to inhumane paranormal experiments. Now its walls speak to the chaos and suffering that took place when a rift to another world was accidentally opened, unleashing an army of interdimensional creatures. The new killer is... Narius. The Demogorgon. Hi. A blooming mouth full of needle-like teeth. Long, it looks like a flower when it opens up. And powerful legs to pounce on victims make the Demogorgon a frightening monster to face in any dimension. Oh, jeez, no. The Demogorgon is a macabre testament to the horrors lurking in the Upside Down and in the realm of the Entity. Mm. The Demogorgon's power is of the Abyss. Of the Abyss. Catch survivors by surprise. The Demogorgon uses portals run, to traverse girl, the map. Run, girl, run! It begins each trial with a limited number Ew, of portals hand. that can be spawned on any flat ground surface. These allow the Demogorgon to travel through the upside down really from one portal to another so that's why i didn't know because i didn't watch stranger things Morgan to charge up and pounce on its prey from a distance unleashing a vicious i just crash. saw one season and that's it Gorgon <laughs> comes with three new perks surge charge the air and weaken generators downing a survivor causes nearby generators to surge Placing a regression effect on any generators within range. Oh. Cruel limits. Reduce escape options and go in for the kill. Survivors who successfully fix a generator will find nearby windows blocked for a short while. Mm. Mindbreaker. Mindbreaker. Intimidate your prey. Fear, dread, and doubt fill the survivors mentally and physically exhausting them as they repair generators. New survivor, Nancy Wheeler. Nancy Wheeler. Nancy Wheeler is a stubborn investigator with an instinct for a good story. Pursuing a lead one evening, she fearlessly approaches the Hawkins National Laboratory before suddenly losing consciousness. A moment later, she awakens in a strange, misty realm with the sound of a familiar roar echoing through the air. Oh yeah, okay. Nancy Wheeler comes with three new perks. Better together. Help others. Help yourself. Reveal the generator you are repairing to nearby survivors. If the killer downs a survivor while you're repairing the generator, all survivors are revealed to you for a moment. Fixated. Nothing fixated. stands in your way. Your tracks are revealed to you. And when you're uninjured, you can walk faster than usual without leaving any tracks for a killer to follow. Well, nice. Inner strength. Look inward and trust your instincts. Cleanse a totem to activate this perk. Once activated, you can enter a locker to gather your strength and heal. New survivor, Steve Harrington. Steve Harrington is an unlikely mentor and leader. One evening, he received a call for assistance from his friend Nancy Wheeler. He drove all the way to the Hawkins National Laboratory, searched the area. Before he realized what was happening, the ground opened 
and a swirl of black mist filled his eyes. When he yeah. awakened, he was in a strange place that seemed familiar yet unfamiliar at the same time. Mm. Steve Harrington comes with three new perks. Babysitter. Babysitter. Risk it all to save a friend. The survivor you save from a hook leaves no blood trail or scratch marks for a short time. This bold and courageous act also allows you and the killer to see each other's aura for a short time. Oh, Camaraderie. Cool. Friends bring you strength. Survivors who come close to you as you struggle against the entity on a hook will give you hope and strength, briefly pausing the struggle phase timer. Second wind. One good turn deserves another. When you heal a survivor, the perk activates. If you unhook yourself, or you are unhooked by a survivor, you heal automatically. There are things that lurk beyond the boundaries of the known world. Horrific the whole area is so cool, but also creepy. That thing. Ooh. That thing! Well, he is enjoying the his Stranger meal. The Stranger Things chapter is available now. I mean, Everywhere. it looks like a flower. Look at that. Like, come on. The Ghost Face. Ghost is Face! The and latest chapter. Nice. Dead by Daylight. Acquaintances can be dangerous deceptions. Our workplace is filled with them. Strangers sitting beside us five days a week. True that. A distant familiarity grows from habit. And the blanks are filled with assumptions as we forget how little we know. That is, until they prove us wrong. The new killer is called Hi, Ghost the face. Ghost face. You A creep. Part of him always remained hidden from view. Each morning he'd suppress his nature, putting on the mask of normality. At night, however, he'd reveal his true face. Shrouded in darkness, he would become the ghost face. A the white ghost face. In the night that stalked his victims before sneaking inside their home. The ghost face's power. I mean, it's anybody shroud. too. That's the creepy Why thing about screen is movies is that it's anybody. No red stain, they just will never give ghost face up. Shrinks to nil, which allows him to stalk survivors. He goes yeah. into stealth mode and stays that way as long as he And then he takes a picture. I remember. From all survivors. Selfie time. Stalking survivors makes them suffer from the exposed status for a limited time. Go on. To stalk Selfie. More the ghost face can lean around corners and crouch at will. The I want to see him do the selfie. Like, it, show the selfie part. That evil. part I like, because that was like, when yeah, that's straight up ghost face. Action outside your terror radius. Their aura is revealed for a limited time. It then goes into cooldown. Thrilling tremors. After picking up a survivor, all generators not being repaired by survivors are blocked by the entity and cannot be worked on for a limited time. The affected generators are outlined in white. Furtive chase. You become obsessed with one survivor. When your obsession is hooked, the perk receives a token. Each token decreases your terror radius during the chase. The next time a survivor rescues someone from the hook, the rescuer becomes the obsession. Oh, I bet. There is no telling what lies behind a smile. Uh huh, yeah. Can be the most Chase! Pum pum, I like that. Chapter is available now. That's so ghost face. Here is the new chapter for Dead by Daylight. Witness the demise of the faithful. Okay. When surrounded by darkness and doubt, some look inward for a beacon of light to follow, hoping it will lead them to safety. But when that light is distorted by pride and ambition, how long will they wander around in the darkness of their own minds? 
Enter the Temple of Purgation, a long-forgotten temple complex dedicated to the cleansing of the High Priestess's followers. Stolen from the Priestess's memories, the temple is now planted in the middle of the Red Forest. The impressive construction, once believed to be supporting the entire weight of the heavens, is now being eroded into oblivion by the chill winds of the forest. The new killer oh, is her. called the Plague. Yes. She was once a high priestess, devoted to the gods with an unwavering faith. Back in Babylon, she looks kind of dope. And amulets were created in her honor, praising her beauty and force. Look how she walks. Sadly, you go, woman. She lived in a time of despair, while a dark plague was gaining ground and rapidly spreading across Babylon. Her faith proved to be inconsequential against the disease, no matter the prayers or mm. the rituals. She's like, I'm gonna take my sweet time because I'm gonna catch them anyways. She keeps trying to appease the gods with more blood and more sacrifices. The plague's power is vile purge. Vile purge. Power, she releases a Yes, I remember. Gross. Her victims. Once infected, survivors will cough and retch. And if they do not take care of it, the sickness will take over. Ooh, ew. <laughs> that, that is gross. Ain't no way. You could very easily catch it too. The plague. And I bet it's delish. Okay, let me stop. <laughs> Y'all probably like, ill, gross. With one survivor. Using your basic attack on the obsession causes them to emit a terror radius. During that time, your own terror radius is reduced to zero. The obsession will hear the terror radius they emit. Infectious fright. Any survivors within the killer's terror radius, while another survivor is put into the dying state with a basic attack, will yell and reveal their location to the killer. Why yell? Come on, what? Intervention. <laughs> The generators located furthest from you are blocked by the entity at the start of the trial for a limited duration. Survivors cannot repair these generators during that time. New survivor, Jane Romero. This influential talk show host was raised by her I was father, like, yeah, she looks like a talk show host or like a news person. Her genuine material and strong personality helped her gather a large loyal audience. Her success also meant an increasingly demanding schedule and harsh critics' reviews. One evening, after a TV special on divorce, she drove to her father's house. When she closed her eyes to rest and opened them moments later in the realm of the entity. Oh, jeez. Okay. comes with three new perks. Poised. Poised. Achieving goals boosts your confidence. After a generator is completed, you leave no scratch marks for a short duration. Okay. Head on. Head on. Performing a rushed action to exit a locker you are hiding in will stun a nearby killer for a short duration. Ooh. Head on cannot be used while exhausted. Solidarity. Solidarity. Painful experiences has the power to heal. While injured, healing the survivor also heals you. When surrounded by darkness, the faithful look inward for a beacon of light to follow. But when their light is distorted by pride and ambition, how I mean, she is fast. Like, whoa, girl. Ooh, behind the demise you. <laughs> of the faithful chapter is available now everywhere everywhere i like when he says everywhere all right guys so that is it for the part two video of this i will return for part three dead by daylight spotlights i believe 
I'll finish all the Dead by Daylight Spots on my part 3 video. Hopefully, fingers crossed, who knows, we will see. Other than that, guys, I'm glad that the narrator is back. It's so weird without his voice narrating, so it's good that he returns. I'm like, yes, baby, yes, keep him coming, keep him coming. But other than that, guys, that is it for this video. Chills, I explode. Yes, this girl is out. You guys stay lit and peace.